Well, that homeowner requested privacy, so I can't tell you exactly which neighborhood this home is in, but I can tell you it has sweeping views of the Golden Gate Bridge and is valued at $5.3 million. So, as you can imagine, what happened inside is a total nightmare. It was horrible. Horrible. The person who was renting here had defecated through the entire home and urinated all over the place. This is what realtor and property manager Egan Lim walked into just a few days ago and prompted him to call in Private Clean, a crime scene cleaning crew. It was something out of a horror movie. It was pretty bad. People from the outside walking by could smell. So you had joggers stopping going, uh... Wow, what's that smell? The $5.3 million home in one of San Francisco's toniest neighborhoods, ransacked by the renter inside. This was a queen bed. It was a headboard right here. There, there was blood stains. To give you an idea of just how bad this home was, take a look at this bucket. It's filled with about 150 needles, most of them for drug use. This in-law suite was rented for three and a half months for $100 a night through Airbnb. Lim can't even estimate how much damage was done. We're going to file a complaint, a uh, more formal complaint. Airbnb does have a $1 million host guarantee in case of damages. The company sent us this statement saying in part, in 2017, there were more than 49 million trips at Airbnb listings worldwide. Significant property damage was reported to us only 0.004% of the time. Something even Lim agrees with and says won't deter him from managing properties through rental sites. I use Airbnb myself. I'm very confident still using Airbnb and any of the other um, vacation rental sites, anybody subject to this type of um, vandalism. Believe it or not, after all of this headache, after the trauma of going through this, the homeowner and the property manager say they will indeed rent the unit out again, although they will be installing security cameras outside.